All right, Poro, time to say hi. Don't do anything sus this time. Hi, Poro. We're gonna be going through the dialogue pretty quickly. We're just here for transfers. Yeah, hi. <laughs> Spin. Yeah, you're totally invisible, man. Can't see you there. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, yeah, Poro, I'm I see you. You can you can get out of there. Hi. Do not be afraid, I will not assimilate you. I am different from them. Please do not worry. You must have seen the tips I left behind. I knew that human must be very smart and excellent. For a human, it must surely be easy to get here. We'll be going through the dialogue quickly. I've been waiting for your awakening for a long time. I hope you will not be disappointed because I am a latex beast. You must have gone a long path, right? Are you going to take a break and listen to what the latex beast says? I won't do anything. Please believe me. Suddenly a little nervous. I never thought you would actually come. What should I do? Well, let's save first. You're already tense and breathless. You didn't expect a talking latex beast to be waiting for you, but maybe he can help you escape from here. Talk to him. Ah, we get a save for free. Beautiful. Uh, how about we just get good instead? <laughs> oh! <laughs> and then there's that super cute and wholesome pic. But I don't want to be a goo, though. Two goo puddles in the room with Puro. Got it. Yes, Puro is here. Eh, huh? Human, are you serious? In front of me. Yeah, I'm serious. The YouTubes demanded it. <laughs> and I obey the YouTubes. <laughs> Big as wild eye. And then this one. This one makes me a waifu goo. A goofu. <laughs> eh, huh? Human, are you serious? In front of me. I twirly twirl my goo hair. Is it really hair anymore? If it's made of goo, it's latex hair. All right. Mm, let's see. I can also run on this. You like this? When you step on the goo dripping for me, I can feel it too. So respect me and stop stepping on it. When you say... <laughs> okay, fine. I'll stop. I have to talk to you. I'm glad you didn't run away. You chose to believe me. Um, let me introduce myself. My name is Puro. If I had a gender, I should be male. As you can see, I am a latex beast, a monster. Ordinary, unremarkable, dedicated to the pursuit of excellence monster. But essentially, I'm almost the same as those outside that will assimilate you. You would do best by not accidentally stumbling into my arms. The consequences are very serious. After I learned of your existence, I have been always wanting to see you with my own eyes, but there was a strange doctor who blocked all access to you. He welded the door shut, turned on the combination locks, and set up many obstacles. He did all this to avoid you escaping from this institute after waking up. And I, in order to get you here safely, also made a lot of preparations. I have posted reports along the way to help you understand the situation. I also wrote a lot of important tips in person. I don't know if human has read it carefully, but because I'm not very good at writing, there are so many spelling errors. But still have to say human. The human race, it's really excellent. Even if I leave a reminder, so many difficulties and obstacles are not so easy to pass. But you really did it. You eliminated all difficulties, solved so many puzzles, and came to the library. Excellent. It's an honor to be able to talk to a real human being in a higher life that created us. I've never had a genuine dialogue with others because here I am the only person. I am a stray wolf. I actually, I haven't seen humans other than that strange doctor. Even that strange doctor, I have never really seen him. And I, I have never left this institute, so I, do not, I don't know anything about the outside world. Since I can remember, this institute is already like this. Sorry, I don't know how to leave this institute. I originally wanted to rely on that method. No, never mind. This research institute is intricate, full of various latex beasts and locked doors. Although I am also a latex beast, the relationship between the white latex beast and the black latex beast is not good. If I hurriedly explored in the institute, I might be caught by the white latex beast. But don't worry, I am not weak. There are so many white latex beasts outside the library door and I am not afraid. They were originally the food reserves I raised. Just accidentally made their numbers get out of control and they taste so bad. I read in the book that humans also keep some animals as a stable food source, so I wanted to try that too. When it comes to reading, I love reading. The book is the most indispensable thing in the entire library. In my lonely days, these books are all my life. The book tells a lot of stories about the outside world and describes a lot of things about the outside world. I yearn for good human beings, but also for the outside world. Unfortunately, I'm just an ordinary latex beast and I don't even have the courage to leave this institute. I feel like I digress. Sorry. I'm so lonely. I finally have someone to talk to and I accidentally said a lot. This is the first time someone is willing to listen to me. I'm so excited. I hope you don't mind human. I'm just too lonely. Just... Do you want to leave the library? Yes. I want to go home. 
Won't you stay a little longer? For you too, leaving the Institute is the primary goal. I remember that behind the pile of books there was a keycard. As long as you have the keycard, you can open all the doors in the library. Human, you can find it. Oh no, you remember what happens here? You remember what happens here? The bit skip side, there should be some transfers of the two side rooms. Got it, thank you. Well, we don't go in the side rooms right away. We have to go all the way back to the bird area. That's why. So the side rooms are later. I really want this. Mr. Pura, why are you looking at my butt and saying you really want this? <laughs> Is this really what I want? I can't do it. Mr. <laughs> D don't turn around suddenly. You scared me a lot. D don't worry. I just, just came to see if you found it. It looks like you found the key card. Uh, you know where to go, right? But that place. It's better to go and see for yourself. I won't run around with you. If you still need help, just come back and find me. <laughs> All right, Poro. Human, when you stuck out your butt just now, what? I found your tight pants have a strange smell. <laughs> Poro, what are you trying to tell me? What's this about my butt and, and tight pants and a smell? I mean, the tight pants don't smell like pants. There's something weird and familiar to me. Maybe my imagination. Hmm, sure, Poro. What did I say, Poro? I said, don't be sus. And you're being extra sus right now. The key card has been obtained. Gotta open the door. What is it that it said at the beginning of the game? Oh yeah, your pants don't have any pockets, so why did you even go for that star? Meanwhile, I shoved this keycard, like, into my pants. Like, on the inside. So I could have done the same with the shiny. And no worries, well, I'll die. Alright, let's keep going forward. Aw, oh, sorry to hear, Prime. I hope things get better for you soon. Let's remember to keep things positive, please. Alright, save. <laughs> Poor... <laughs> what are you doing, Poor Oh, you derp. Mm -hmm. No, the pawsies don't stink. They smell just fine. Pawsies are hungry, though. They need food. Let's go through the door at the end of the balcony. Go through the door at the end of the bathroom. Through the door? <laughs> Poor old I was worried, so I followed. You, you don't like it. Okay. <laughs> oh, now be sure to stay safe. I will wait for you in the library. What the heck? <laughs> My pleasure, Fryman. I'm here for you. You can send me a DM if you want. I'm happy to help. The Pawsies smell like snow. Correct. Because I am an ice dragon. The Pawsies walk in the snow. Can't push. We'll push this one. Oh, jeez. Are there more burbs than before? No! Oh my gosh, I almost got gooed. No! Go! Oh, that was too close. Alright. Alright, key card is in. Bro, Pawsies, we move forward. All right, he's been watching our movies. He is, he's stalking me. Hey, Wichter, how's it going? Like snow or like ice cream? The question is what flavor? Like snow. Like if you just, if you just took snow and shoved it in your mouth, it would taste like that. Plus, you know, pawsies. It would taste like pawsies too. Dragon paws. That was really close. No, I'm not Yumsies, Wichter. Oh, I don't want to do this room again. Oh, jeez. That guy actually let you go. The failed sample is still disappointing as always. He set up so much help and so many tips. Countless times making t trouble in my arrangement. Do you really think he did so much just to meet you? Uh, yeah. What a ridiculous idea. Of course all he did was order to assimilate you. I let you reach the library just to use him to assimilate you. I thought he would ambush you, but he just let you go. What's in his goo head? My original plans failed, one after another. But what I still have is to stop you. Not letting you go is to save you, but also to save everyone. You can't understand my good intentions. I did it to keep you alive. Hmm, just stay here and don't move. Dodge! I knew I shouldn't have gotten a laser sight. 
But it doesn't matter if you see it. I still have confidence to hit you. After the riots, there were many guns left in the Institute. And I also had time to practice shooting. This gun is filled with special injections. Just one shot. The dose of medicine inside is enough to make you a beast. Come on, it won't hurt. Just have to hit your head. <laughs> Don't mess around. I can't even get your head in my sight. The medicine the shot only works when it hits the head. That being the case... As long as you can't hide. If you're caught by his laser, he will shoot. You know that you will be hit in this way. Don't run away. Look here. Whew. You succeeded. At the moment the laser scanned you, you took a big step, the bullet shattered the glass, and, and hit a magazine behind you. I'm a little angry. <laughs> Do you know how much energy it takes to make such a bullet? I only have four shots in total. Hope you won't make me waste any more. Keep doing this until he runs out. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, no. I got turned into a dog. I think beastization is complete. Listen to my voice now. Think about who you are. <gasps> no, don't have to know me. Accept it. Accept new you. Accept this feeling. No, resist. Resist. You should follow orders, puppy. Ah! Puppy! I'm a dragon! No! Resistance is futile. The medicinal effect is just working. <laughs> you are so good now. Oh no. Resist! Fight! Don't give in! Don't give in! Don't give in! Don't give in! Don't! No! 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 <laughs> oh! That's right. It's wrong. It's so very wrong. I'm not a good boy. Oh, no. That's not good. Okay, this time we win. This time we get the cannon ending. I don't remember how this works. How do I get him to shoot? It maybe? Oh yeah, yeah, that's what you gotta do. You guys did. Oh, if you try to open the door, you get shot. Okay. I didn't realize. I. Oh, okay, it's actually really easy. <laughs> the wireless bump signal. There is no wireless bump signal. I admit that my shooting ability is not at a high level. I'm a doctor, not a sniper. The recoil of the shots almost dislocated my arm. Oof. You're lucky. I have nothing to do to you now. I also finally understood how you broke through those obstacles. You are a really agile hazard. But I will not give up. Next time I'll find more efficient means of turning into a beast. Hope you remember that everything need not be so complicated. I also have something I have to protect. Mmm. Pro pauses. What? Actually, I just locked you in here. Isn't it done once and for all with this now? But trapping you will only take everything go to the worst outcome. It's my ultimate goal to make you beast. Something opened. Now go. There are so many latex bees still waiting for you. Mm. Yeah, he shoots the head, but like... He won't shoot unless it lines up with your head for at least a second. That's why you have to dash through it. Okay. Are there any new transfers in this room? I don't remember. I know we get attacked by the tail beast again. Oh boy. Is there is there anything new in this room, Wild High? I need to know. Is that mm, yeah, there's pictures and there's goo puddle. Okay, so we need the goo puddle and the pictures. Got it. She gone for that. This guy went for it. Well, at least we got past the sniper part. Now we got to get past this goo part. 
As always, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like. It's time.